Hello everyone, Jax is returning once again for some commentary. This is Grand Finals, not Losers Grand Finals. Just standard Grand Finals. <laughs> um, between G-Man, Zelda, and Urban Lion, Ness. G-Man is the one who knocked me out of uh, the top slot. And Urban Lion is, I believe, undefeated at this point. I know that he is at least undefeated in matches, as far as PM goes. I'm not sure about Melee. Also, stay tuned, and after this happens, we will get uh, top four, then finals up for Melee as well. Anyways, this match is between two Magic users. Both have pretty solid disjointed hitboxes and some surprising kill power uh, compared to the other games, such as Sweet Spot and Forward Air. Ness... Apparently being really heavy or something, because he is just not dying. And back throw, a really good kill option, but definitely not at kill percent. Put some good damage on, though. <laughs> G-Man putting out a Din's Fire, and doing the run into PK Thunder Gimp. <laughs> G-Man expressing it being totally on purpose and not a down air attempt. We all believe him. Anyways, uh, Urban Lion still very definitely has the advantage right now. A very solid uh, stock lead, though G-Man is starting to bring this back pretty well. Back throw will not quite kill, but that spells disaster for G-Man right now. If he gets one grab on him, then that is game. He has to play extremely safe. <laughs> Tech the down air, and he will air dodge off the ledge. I think he attempted to tech on the platform, but it did not work so well. So, game one of this best of five set goes to Urban Lion. are selecting Meta stages. Knight. So like G-Man's gonna try Meta Knight this time instead of Zelda. Surprising, I haven't actually seen him play anyone other than Zelda, though I do know that he said he'd messed around with Meta Knight a little bit, and it was really fun. So let's see how it stacks up against Urban's Ness. Okay, he almost just killed himself. Did not quite, though. Managed to do it high enough to be able to grab the ledge afterwards with that mid-air air dodge off stage. Ness's PK Fire is very difficult to smash DI out of. I believe the only real way to do so is with Quarter Circle DI, but it's it's very difficult. Compared to most moves, at least. And it does give him some very solid options uh, when you get stuck in it, because he can just run up and grab you. And as we all know, Ness's back throw is an amazing kill, too. He, too. All right. Down B. Apparently a solid kill move for Meta Knight now. Anyways, um, Ness's back throw is an amazing kill move. Easily the poster child for kill throws. But with an up smash, Urban's Ness will bring that right back, giving a quick okay taunt, and then we get right back into it. Uh, G-Man trying to keep Ness in the air above him. Fails, ends up running <laughs> into the ground. 
G-Man exclaiming, why did I do that, as he runs into the yo-yo. Oh, Urban do uh, dodging the down smash, punishing with a grab. G-Man not... Alright, G-Man not going to be able to recover, apparently. Down throw deals some very solid damage from Meta Knight. Looks like his back air got changed pretty heavily, too. It's no longer three slashes. I think that G-Man's small experience with Meta Knight and Brawl is kind of screwing him over here because his up B appears to not go quite as high, whereas in Brawl it goes a little bit more distance and he keeps misjudging the height he needs to be at to get to the ledge. Down smash, having a lingering hitbox, very good attack, especially if you're not used to it. <laughs> Urban failing the recovery, G-Man throwing out a taunt, but this is still very much an uphill battle for G-Man. At 62%. <laughs> good punish, G-Man, as he's saying over there. Um, Back throw, not at kill percent yet. Just manages to barely dodge the forward smash, but not that second one. And with that, Urban Lion takes game two of this best of five set. It is now set, or match point, tournament point even, for Urban Lion. G-Man has some ground to make up, but we have seen crazier things from him before. So let's see how this goes. He is the Cosmic Destroyer, after all. Sounds like they're going to... Nope, they're banning your Island. I'm not sure what they're doing, as I... They only have two bans. But... Maybe their gentleman's ruling something. Anyways. Looks like G-Man's going with his tried and true Zelda. Hoping to pull something out a bit better this time against, uh, G... Not G-Man, Urban Lion's Ness. Stage is green greens, and the match is on. Uh, Zelda's up smash is not tall enough to hit through the platforms here, so that is not not the best thing. But, <laughs> uh, Urban Lion faking out, going for himself, ends up hitting G-Man instead. G-Man just gets his shield up on the PK Thunder too. Ness is racking some very solid damage right now, and he jump into forward smash. <laughs> Ooh, G-Man gets caught in the very end of his spot dodge by, uh, not Din's Fire, by PK Fire, but does manage to punish Urban Lion with Nehru's Love, which then chained into uh, Urban's PK Fire, as it did reflect it. Manages to get him off stage, get the kill. He was too far to recover. And with that, this is a fairly close match again. Ooh, Zelda's down smash, getting both hits, getting some very solid damage in. Punishing the ledge get up option. Using Din's Fire for just a little bit of extra damage racking. Looks like Ness's uh, back air is pretty similar to Zelda's as far as kill potential. Also requires a sweet spot, unless that's changed heavily since uh, Melee and Brawl. G-Man not wanting any of uh, PK Thunder, tries to reflect it. Does run out just before it gets to him, though. Ness's back throw will take the stock. And, wow, 54% from two, uh, din or two PK Fire and a down throw. That was 0 to 54 right there. G-Man, kind of struggling to get back on stage, does not get spiked. Manages to DI or smash DI, not sure which, back onto the stage. But having a very difficult time landing. Who just gets a shield up to not be hit and killed by that forward smash. 
Uh, Ness attempting to use PK Magnet? I don't know what that's actually called. To absorb PK Fire, or er, Din's Fire. I'm not getting confused with this at all. But does not end up working. Ooh. Urban Lion coming back in from the stock loss. Just one hit. Gets rid of Zelda. And this is back to a very uphill battle for G-Man. Ew, if you'd managed to reflect PK Thunder without hitting him, then that would have been a stock. However, he gets the stock anyways without taking dent, and he ran straight into the down smash again. But this gives him a much stronger comeback potential as the start of the stock was even, and it basically still is. Ooh, nice stall by G-Man, just avoiding the smash attack by Ness. <laughs> Uses the down smash charge to set up some PK fire. Covers his spot dodge. Could not see it through the um, flowers on the stage. It's like G-Man is not wanting to let Ness get back to a comfortable portion of the stage. Definitely wants that stage control that he's fighting for. But looks like Ness and Zelda have about even at this point. G-Man was unable to keep it, but does not get killed by a back throw out of... Um, <laughs> Urban absorbing Din's fire, but a back throw out of the PK fire. Uh, Urban Lion just missed spacing and getting hit by the up B hitbox on appearance from Zelda, and a grab there would have ended this game and this tournament, but he did not decide to go for it for whatever reason. Gets hit again by the... Uh, that just barely landed. Up smash will not take it. This stage has a huge ceiling. Oh, G-Man missing the punish that could have been game. But Urban Lion not miss missing his. And with that, he gets first in the Project M tournament. Congratulations to Urban Lion. He is our first Project Melee tournament winner.